Hi there. In this tutorial, we're going to learn how to write entire article using Talk to Oli, the TTW. Okay, so let's get started. I open this document. So for the title, it will go How to use AI text generator to write an entire entire blog post on any topic. Then once we have it, if we have search engine optimization in mind, so it should go as a title, it will become heading one, so hit on your keyword control Alt and one, it will become heading one. And then we're going to start using TTW to create our outline for this particular article. But now, uh, here we go. Grammarly is kind of a useful tool. All right, so let's get started. I'm going to copy that. I'm going to Text Generator. And I'm going to hit the title. And let's see what we got with that prompt. TW will generate an article for us, a kind of, let's see, we're going to start blank, okay? So how it reads, if you want to use an AI text generator to write an entire blog post on any topic, you will first need to find a suitable text generator tool. That's right. And then, there are many different ways, that's probably best, text, I, text generators, etc. I think it's going to be good for a introduction or an opening paragraph so we can use it. Simply copy the text and we go with the first paragraph and we're just going to enter that. Now let's think about what we can generate more and how to structure the article. Now after analysis if let's say once you have found a text generated tool. Okay so we get <clears throat> Excuse me. And we go into TTW and we're going to enter that and modify the prompt just to let know AI that we want to write, uh, that we found a tool which is TTW and then we're going to find some topics, right? I have a few topics here, so uh, let's say change words in essay, maybe to newspaper, article outline, that's an introduction. Okay, so I can choose write blog posts for money. Who doesn't want more money, right? So we can use it, let's say. So uh, think about prompt, that's the most important thing. More information the, uh, you will give TTW than you get better results. Now, so we want to give a, um, the AI kind of subtopics, let's say. Write a few topics on how to write and blog posts for money and where to publish them, where to get started. Okay. Let's hit enter, we'll see. Anytime you want to uh, troubleshoot that, you can generate as, as many times as you want. For example, you, you, you can copy the text and you can use it in here. Then you're going to edit that. Generate more. Freelance writer writing, um, gigs that pay Fiverr or people per hour, legit, another one, Upwork. Okay, so once we have a couple of topics, we can think about them in terms of uh, which one we want to choose, which one um, 
the most compelling to us and how we're going to write about them, how we're going to expand on each of the subtopics to make the text uh, this article more more in proper way as you can say you, you can put some structure into it so you're gonna write a heading two tag and uh, let's write let's say let's write about and we can take that from this section so uh, let's write a few uh, How to write blog posts for money and where to get started. That's going to be our heading two. So again, control Alt and two on your keyboard, and you got to convert a paragraph into heading two, H1. Okay, let's put kind of intro and let's go with this and write introduction or generate Okay, and hit generate text. Mm -hmm. So we have it. How does it read? I'm looking for ways. Of, um, there are a number of ways to monetize a blog and turn it into passion, into profits, and yeah, it sounds good. So let's copy the text. Let's generate another one so we can choose which one we prefer. And what we got? Let's see. Now, extra cash. That looks extra cash. I love these words. <laughs> Who doesn't, right? Okay. If you can do this, we'll make a money on blog post. Okay, let's copy the text and we have the intro. All right, so once we have it, um, we, we can get some uh, subtopics and we, we can make we can make um, this article sections based on this particular subtopics. All right, so how to get started as a freelance writer. Okay, so we're going to write like this, expand use topic. Detailed instructions or prompts always needed. So let's say write a few paragraphs on this. Okay. Let's see what we got next. That should generate a section for us. Mm, and how does it read? That sounds good. It's a, a community. Join the community to be build portfolio. So uh, it will be easier for you while you have this tool available so you, you can get started right away. Okay, let's copy the text and let's get uh, back to our document and let's paste that these paragraphs and how does it read. If you particularly like any of the paragraphs, you can expand on them as well. Simply, uh, let's say, for example, the, uh, the article about the communities. Uh, you can take this snippet, this paragraph, or a part of the paragraph, and write some more about it. So, what's the ways? List 10 ways, for example, or expand on the topic, write a few paragraphs. Uh, how to find a way to get started as a freelance writer. Uh, mm, so, better, better English, please. Okay, how to find communities. Okay, a community of other writers.
that offer support and advice for new writers. And these communities can be a great resource for finding new clients and getting your own name out there. Exactly. All right, so let's hit generate now. Anytime, go to talktowoli.com and check it out today and get started with your new career. All right, so what we have here, there are a few ways to go about finding community rights that offer support and advice. The first will be to do a search online for writing communities. That's very insightful, I would say, and I will go for it. They should bring up a few different options for you to choose from and all right, I like that. So let's copy that and use it. So we can do as a bullet points, for example. Mm. Okay, let's get it back. Control Z again on your keyboard. A few shortcuts for you as a pro tip. I thought it may be a, a bullet point. Why not? There are a few ways. Okay, and. Do I do it right? I think so. Okay. We got to check it out afterwards anyway. So the top three ways, for example, top three ways, top three methods, ways. Okay, top three ways, let's say ways. Hit the <laughs> top three ways of, uh, oh, I, should, I should expand my English as well. Let me pause this video a bit. Quick sip of water and I'm back. Top three ways of joining, supporting new writers' communities. Is that, is that proper English? I think so. Okay. By the way, if you're not sure about the grammar, you can do uh, you can do something like you can check the grammar actually or you can correct let's say correct this to standard english and you enter your your phrase in this case was um top three ways of joining supporting uh yeah it it doesn't sound right to me so probably it's going to be corrected let's see and then you're going to hit enter and i will top three ways of joining new writers communities are as follows. Yeah, I could be better, I think. Now, so we have it. So let's do it. Maybe it's um, how to get started as freelancer. So maybe a heading three tag. Okay, and that's going to be heading four just to keep um, um, structure for search engine optimization purposes. Now, as you see, so we have uh, around, let's see how many words do we have so far, word count. Yeah, 700 in a few minutes, I would say, yeah, 15 minutes, like on my clock, 13 actually, with me talking, so I, I can't really f uh, f focus while typing. And do you know what it is? How it is? Okay, you can check in. A, you, you can check it out in the um, plagiarism tools. Just check it out against Grammarly. Let's say plagiarism checker. That is a free one in here. You can find that the search engine report. All the links will be in the uh, video description below. Okay, then you're gonna just enter that text, not this one text but uh, our text. So I'm going to copy that and go into the tool and I'm going to hit enter and I'm not the bot. Okay, that's the traffic lights and check plagiarism if I'm, if I may. Okay, and then the tool will, uh, act, will automatically che check for each of the sentences against other content online using Google search and Grammarly. So we can check back in a second. 
Okay, it took a few minutes to check it out. And as we can see, that's mostly, as we see in here, checked 100%, plagiarized 10%, and unique 90%. So nine out of the 10 words are unique. So to give you, you can see the results. That's sometimes it's so hard like this. Don't give up if you don't. So uh, if it's so difficult to, to write fully 99, 100% unique, but when you go to a Grammarly is unique. So another one in here. So that's all checked and it's unique. So getting back to the article, where are we at? Okay, that's the supporting communities for freelance uh, freelancers and how to get started to make money online writing articles. Now, uh, again, if you want to try this tool, go to talktoolly.com. That's the URL in here. Once you have it, simply sign out, uh, sign in, go to pricing, new page. So let me open in incognito mode. Uh, actually, I can think, I think I can see it while, while I'm on uh, log it in. Yeah. So uh, it's $1 only for seven days and then 49 per month and with no limits. You can generate as many articles, words you can dream of. Now, if I, I did put a $1 because the tool was just overwhelmed with, uh, with uh, users that been extensively using our server's resources. So I had to just uh, limited about thousand of inputs so uh, that's why we we did the one dollar just to to give an access almost for free right one dollar come on and then you can see uh, I put together using TTW and generated some of the copy and let me let me summarize that as the GPT-3 algorithm. We use the newest version of OpenAI, despite some of the other tools out there. Uh, and it is the best quality, as you've noticed, while generating, while we going through the, the article. And you can check the grammar as well. And we're working on some more features and you can find more the, the upcoming features going to a tutorial page where well, I uh, recorded quick videos, so one, two, three minutes maximum videos for you just to, 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 to let you, to get you started right off the bat. Maybe I, I will restructure that a little bit. It might be, um, it's not that clear to read, right? Okay, if you have any suggestions, please let me know in the comments below. So I can uh, I can improve the content here in tutorials if you if you think I'll be better option to redesign a little bit to, to be more concise clear but it looks good on mobile device by the way you can see that's on a laptop version but you can see let's say iPhone or whatever uh, it displays well and I think it's a good structure if you if you some if you have some suggestions please let me know it'll be easier for for all of us to just to use the tool and make some money right <laughs> or just a brainstorm ideas just learn ways to communicate with others a tool is it is like a really how to say it is like your assistant or your co-worker or your uh, it's like a Wally. You have your own robot that it's um, next to you. You can use it on mobile as well. When you go to a mobile version of the page, let's say generator, you can easily do it on your phone while you while you have a few minutes instead of browsing social. You can get it and uh, make it work in like this, and it's, it's easy enough. That will look like on your iPhone, and it's, and it's a lightning with lightning speed, really. Okay, that's enough of the rant. Let's get back to the article. Let's break storm a couple of other ideas. Okay, so we now in the communities, writing communities, let's put it in the bold. Uh, it makes it easier to read and go through the content. Uh, another type of 
community is going to do another bullet point here it will be a to ask your local library on the bookstore really yeah i never thought about it okay anyway <laughs> sounds good to me and uh, different options and and the groups communities and so forth all right so let's list top of communities and uh, because I'm, I'm i'm kind of curious what are they so uh here are some here are supporting let's say here are here are <laughs> so okay let me pause that okay so we got it it has some supporting communities for freelance writers and do the h5 and now that so you can see in a nice um, outline in here and let's list a couple of them uh, so let's ask wally correct english put in a different window we have that let's say another let's start uh okay so uh let's put in there and the list top or at ten top supporting community for freelance writers and I hit enter generate text Wally to the do it yeah communities guru people per hour content <coughs> that's it okay this is where you can get started excuse me <laughs> okay uh now we have it in here so let's put it in into our article now here you can link out to them so wordpress community what is a wordpress community you can expand on them right what is uh, how wordpress community can support a writer because i don't know actually how a WordPress community can support freelance writers. I can learn something new. Uh, with a platform to share their work. Yeah, that's right. That's the support. I'm using WordPress, right? That's the no-brainer. Okay, so you can ex and expand on that. Can we close that distraction? Okay, back to article, and you know, you can expand on them as well. Let's put it this way. Okay, so you have it. And you can go with the medium. Why not? So it's just uh, do it like this. You can support flows right in many ways. For example, you can, you can provide feedback on it. There we go, very good. Again. Do it this way. Hop pages. And so forth. Okay, let's copy that. Go here. Hopspot can you can support filial writers. Alright, so let's have a look. Connecting them with potential clients. Mm, beautifully. Simple. Down to the point and put it like this okay and the freelancer that's the where all the it's similar to uh, hub pages and upwork where i'm a member of guru people power fiverr contently pro blog and i didn't know i, I don't know that the platform actually okay anyway so let's go with the freelancer now mm -hmm. So you, you can see how easy it is. Again, go to talktoorly.com and try this tool now. Copy the text. And bam. Then you have it. Maybe put a nice uh, paragraph line just to make it easier, f to, easier to, to go for, uh, through the content. Okay. No. What next do we have here? Upwork. Oh, 
right? And we have how and up work. But anyway, connect with each other, share, share resources and collaborate on projects, support on, uh, not really, I, I wouldn't, uh -huh, maybe it's an A, we need to. To connect with writers, build relationships. Let's put it this way, and now I'll uh, make a little bit different prompt. So, uh, because I know Upwork a little bit, and I've I've been with the, in the platform for 15 years now, so 10 years. There was a Elance before, but anyway, it was just a rant. Uh, Upwork community, yes, that's right. Because community is that you can ask questions. So, for example, let's go to. Upwork community, yeah, GPT is right, and it's actually more clever than I am because I haven't used Upwork community. There we go. See, you can see uh, for freelancers, and you can use uh, common sense just to do a little bit of due diligence, finding out how they can support you. Yeah, okay, copy text, and let's go for it. Boom. All right. Now, Guru. Is there a Guru community out there? Let's find out how the Guru community. Okay, so uh, let's find out. Mm, space to network, network with other writers, share tips and advice, and access resources that can help them improve their craft. Oh, I love the word craft, it's just something. Something it sounds like uh, I just like it. Okay, Guru. So we have it in here, and now people power. Let's go another one, and just like that, it will be probably similar, isn't it? And the people communicate well, probably when they will probably showcase their work. Connecting with the potential clients, very similar to Upwork, indeed. Build a portfolio, find new writing opportunities, and network with other writers. True. Okay, and do it like that. Fiverr. To make it a little bit different, uh, how Fiverr can you commit? Uh, okay, and you can do something like that. Use keywords. Five bucks. Cheap services. Cheap service and fast. Um, let's say um, fast projects. I will see how we got that. Simply search for keywords like five bucks or a cheap service to find a variety. I didn't mean that so because prompt wasn't right. Uh, it's a it lack of context. So uh, use keywords because it's the community. How a fiber community? Because in the community, it's a, it's a different than using the service as a client versus. Uh, service provider in this case article writing provider so let's stick with the without that and just support how fiverr community community can support writers as question advice find collaborators yeah that makes sense okay so let's go there and contently yeah as i mentioned before i haven't heard about that but you can't know everything, right? So let's find out about the contently, what it's all about and how it can support freelance writers. Uh, share the work, receive feedback from other writers, connect with potential clients. Yeah, it's quite the same. Yeah, we can do it afterwards what's the differences in between, but, but there will be a, a topic for another article, I would say. So let's keep as kind of general for now for the purpose of this 
tutorial and problogger okay an article submissions and additions many bloggers community blogger communities offer discounts on products and services that freelance writers can use to save money on their business expenses okay and here we go now and in this way we have i would say thousand words even more so as you can see that's as easy as it is and it's just a one subtopic of the idea so uh, let's start let's find out about how to make money writing blog posts that's going to be number two where number one was how to get started as a freelance writer that makes sense join communities learn do some research find clients start writing and you're good to go okay so that was a heading two tag yeah the first one was in here no that was a, a height uh, heading three just to keep the structure consistent okay and we're going to elaborate on that how to make money writing blog posts you can add keywords supporting your prompt if you have any you can go to Google for example as a pro tip uh, you can you can scroll down for the mm, suggestions from Google and you can use them as a supporting keywords that will actually improve your SEO score in search engines it's okay so uh, let's hit generate text for now and we will find out about keywords later on okay so we have few ways of course you can as a most common is monetize monetize your blog with advertising that's right adsense media net okay another way to make money to sell products or services affiliate prog products programs fit in quite nicely and finally you can also make money by writing sponsored posts as you see so you have the three blog topics so uh you can copy text like this or you can just highlight all of that both ways will work and so we have another ideas as a say one two three or two point one and then you go into that have a better structure so let's choose the paragraph and let's put another item maybe 1.1 no, maybe we'll maybe do it this way okay and you can expand on that all right and make it get down baby this is another way mm-hmm how to monetize blog using advertised platforms so let's do this prompt how to get started let's say uh, maybe as a prompt expand on this topic maybe if i should i should put uh, write few paragraphs on that okay let's see what wally has to say okay it's another way to monetize blog as a coaching consulting soul services you can resell this tool to somebody else for example your client you can uh, you, you can provide a, um, access to talk to Wally and charge him for, for uh, using the service right on his behalf uh, or if, if that, 
no limits really who you can do with the tool you can uh, expand it the sky's the limit really all right so let's think about it this way or you can work with companies so uh okay so we can my idea is to to put it on that like that or you can directly place and we can and expand on that as well how to work with the company where to find companies and do the deal with them first you need to have a traffic of course but once you have a traffic it'll be easy to sell your space on for their ads okay so uh let's clear this up a little bit so that's this okay this way and we're going to expand on that How to find companies oh, out outreach outreach to companies well, it should be how to do directly but you can correct the grammar right I can use it as a uh, what was it mm, was it in here right correct the grammar Okay, so that's the grammar. Correct this to standard English. I should know what that right? Okay, now there we go. So we got it. Uh, how to go out reach to companies directly to place ads on your blog? It's not quite right, but we can correct it to proper English. Or as English say, how do you outreach the companies directly to place ads on your blog? There we go so we're going back to here scrolling down with the section we left okay and here it is so that's going to be associated with this paragraph so we're not going to cut it off here and as a rant because we love rants right okay so and we're going to expand on that. It might be actually actually useful to directly do it. Mm -hmm. So that we have it in here. And we're going to generate the text to be more precise. Yeah, there are a few ways, of course, as usual. And we'll regard have advertising departments so we need to find the few advertising departments that handle these types of requests uh -huh. now we're going to find out what are these actually advertising departments and how to find them how to locate them it's like a little bit of detective work so let's copy that and we're going to continue that okay and that's going to be in the heading five and we go there and how to find these services or how to find these departments and elaborate on that and so forth and as you can see we have a plenty to work with also when you go to word count you'll see almost 1500 in about i don't know half an hour something like that so summary of that uh, generation we got started with one single keyword phrase as an example how to use a ai text generator to write the entire blog post on any topic so we got started with that and then we went through whole different areas because that's like a tree you climb in the main one and then you reach the branches as as you go 
Now, next, go to the text generator at talktoorly.com and find out more about us and how we got started and how we do it and visit the tutorials. I will, I'll update the page with, um, uh, with this one. And if you have any questions, uh, just reach out to me. Just go in the contact page in here. It's a, it's a blank. <laughs> Sorry about it. We got it. <laughs> we got to submit as technical support to fix that link in here. They should be visible. But anyway, we at the very early stage of redesigning the website, but um, we put uh, a lot of efforts to create that generator based on GPT-3 algorithm from a OpenAI. So now it is your turn and go ahead, sign it up, give it a try. See you on the other side. Thanks for watching. Bye-bye now.